When asked what my favorite pie is, it's generally lemon meringue pie. It's always been one of my favorites, but I recently tasted a version that had me looking at traditional lemon meringue pies from a new angle, upside down. Let me show you what I mean. It's a simple pie to make. You need four egg whites in the bowl of your mixer because this is gonna be the meringue. And you need eight egg yolks for the lemon curd. So you start beating this with one tablespoon of water, which helps break up the albumin. And in the meringue, add a quarter of a teaspoon of cream of tartar. And once the egg whites become soft peaks, start adding one cup of granular sugar slowly. Now gradually add the sugar. So very beautiful meringue. So this gets smoothed into the buttered pie plate. Up the sides and just onto the rim. Now preheat your oven to 300 degrees and you're going to bake this for 40 minutes. Turn off the oven and allow the crust to stay in there for another hour. This is so pretty. This recipe comes from our test kitchen recipe tester's grandmother, Josephine Rige. Put this right into your oven. So now for the lemon curd, which is the filling of our lemon meringue upside down pie. Eight egg yolks, whisk those until they're yellower and gradually add one cup of granulated sugar. And you'll need four teaspoons of lemon zest. And we need six tablespoons of lemon juice. So you're gonna need approximately one and a half lemons. There. So stir this. Make sure you mix everything up. And you can then put aside the whisk and use a wooden spoon as you cook the curd. Now, you never, never, never can leave this on the stove by itself. They will curdle if you cook too hot. Look how quickly it's thickened. This is very nice lemon curd. Turn off the heat and put the curd in a bowl to cool. And it will become even thicker than this as it cools. Put a piece of plastic wrap right on the surface of the curd and let cool in the refrigerator. So now fold one cup of cream whipped into your lemon curd. So now pour this into your shell. And isn't that a gorgeous shell? Look how beautiful, light and airy and perfectly cooked. Little bit of color. So just swirl this and chill. So this beautiful pie has been chilled for approximately eight hours. Top it with stiffly whipped cream. Just a very fine dusting of lemon peel. There. You are going to adore the taste of this extraordinary pie. So that one's for you, and this is all for me. Enjoy. This is a new way of looking at a classic American dessert.